All right, well, here we are. We're in Tower, Minnesota. This is like close to Canada in the north, and this is Sauna Country. Uh, I'm Glenn, and I run a website called Sauna Times, and I'm Ben, and I run Viking Floating Sauna and Prairie Wood Backyard Sauna. And Ben, I love your story because you were a teacher, yep, and pretty. you got into sauna building. You got the sauna bug. Yep. And uh, how many kumas, how many saunas have you built, and how many of them are kumas? So I am on sauna number 13 right now I believe and I think 11 out of 13 have been so yeah so. yeah and you've transitioned you like the low profile as a sauna builder you're very I noticed you're very nuanced about heights yeah. bench heights you're very nerdy about that like does that come from taking like how are you how do you become nerdy about bench heights well stuff? you helped me out quite a bit in that and we nerded out for a while with Viking floating sauna and I think we we hit the nail right on the head with Viking floating sauna yeah, yeah. And height-wise, we had three three benches in there, and that third bench made all the difference in the world. Yeah. So this is so cool because it's about the stove, but how the stove interacts and performs within the cube. And that's why I love builders like Ben, because they take things to that second level. Some just say, what stove do you want? No, Ben builds his saunas around the stove. 100%. And so what are we looking at here, Ben? So this is the new Kuma Low Profile. And the reason I love it, you know, legacies are great. But the low profile is just that. It takes a lower profile. I believe we measured it, and it was almost six inches shorter than the Legacy. Yeah. So with bench height, that makes a big difference. So your feet are essentially at the height of the rock. With a lower ceiling, like what, what ceiling height do you like? Usually between seven feet and seven feet six inches. And I love that height too, right? Because I don't, I, I like the idea of, of easy. I love sauna rounds where you can come and go four or five times and avoiding the bleacher effect is climbing up, climbing down thing. Yeah. You're kind of one with the sauna with a seven foot, seven foot, right? Absolutely. Let, let's, yeah. let's gymnastics. <laughs> exactly. And look at the height where the rocks are right here. I believe yeah. it comes out to 23 inches or somewhere in there, 22, 23 inches, which is just at the right height. So a bottom bench is usually at 18 inches. Yeah, yeah. It's right there. And it's okay to be a low bench, Larry. Yep. Absolutely. Right on. So here we are. We're picking up sauna stoves, low profiles with Ben, very wood Viking floating sauna. I love this stove. I love this place. I love you, man. <laughs> love you too, man. <laughs>